Nowadays, AAA game titles reaching over 100 gigabytes is a common occurrence. That's why we're gonna look at how to set up an external storage for your Xbox and run games off of it. First, plug in your hard drive or a solid state drive to your Xbox console. Then you'll get a prompt that will ask you to choose between media storage or game storage. We'll choose use for games. Then we'll give it a name. Now it will ask you to format it. So make sure to double check if you have any important files in it before formatting. It will ask you to change it to the default install path. We are gonna keep our current location. You can change these settings anytime you want by going to the storage device settings and opening change installation location. And from here you can switch to your external drive. Then you'll get asked if you want to use this storage to play games on other consoles. If you opt in, then you'll be able to run games that you store in it on other consoles directly. So we are definitely gonna go with that. Now your storage drive will format almost instantly and will pop up on your storage devices. Now you can move your games to the external storage or install games directly on it. So let's see how we can move or copy games first. Select your internal storage, then move or copy. From here, select the games you want to move. You can also select all. So let's choose Fall Guys and we'll select move. Confirm it. The time it will require to move depends on your storage device type and its transfer rate. Hard drives tend to be a bit slower than SSDs, but the difference is not that much. But remember that even if your SD card or flash drive has a lot of storage, I don't recommend you to use it because they are not designed to run games. Now that it's done moving, let's check our storage. If we view the contents, you'll see that our game has moved here. Now you can start playing it like you usually do. Just keep in mind that, according to Xbox, games that are optimized for their console and contains the XS optimized logo can only be run from internal storage. And if a game is stored in the external drive, it will be moved back to the built-in storage before you can run it. But most of the optimized games we ran on our external drive launch without any issues. So it turns out that the problem only occurs when you try to run games that are Xbox Series native. But if you are facing issues running the game that are not Xbox optimized, then make sure that you have connected your storage device correctly and they are working properly. That's all there is to it. Now you can stop worrying about running out of space and download all the hot titles out there. If you want to support our work, then consider subscribing. And until next time, good games.